Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be recreating this look. Um, I wore this exact makeup look to the Luxottica event. Uh, I don't know what date it was, but yeah, to the Luxottica event and I posted it on social media and I got quite a good response for you guys saying like all different things about all different things about this makeup look so yeah I thought I would just show you guys exactly how to get it and I also wanted to tell you about these eyelashes so pretty oh my god so yeah if you want to see how to get this simple makeup look please keep on watching okay so to start off I don't even have any like lotion or skin or anything um, like moisturizer or something so I'm gonna use a doctor I think that's how you say it. Ooh. So this is the Rose Day Cream and I'm just gonna put this all over my face. I can hear tie outside my door, like scratching on the door till I come in. But I don't know if any of you guys out there who are like little cat moms or whatever. He always wants to come in and then he wants to leave again. And you're like, what? So I don't know if any of you guys experience that where your cat just wants to be wherever you are and then he decides like no this is boring and then he wants to leave again and it's just like annoying. So I'm going to be using the Inlot Under Makeup Base as my primer. I've used this in my other videos as well. Really just enjoy this product. I need to learn how to put like primer and like moisturizer on in like a very like like graceful way because like right now it's not graceful at all it's like <laughs> Then I'm going in with the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation. I'm in the shade Cashew which I feel like it's going to be changing quite soon because obviously the seasons are changing so I'm gonna need to get a lighter one soon Maybe just like a shade lighter or something, you know. So I'm just going to apply that with a damp beauty blender. If you haven't seen my Estee Lauder tutorial, I'm going to link um, it in the description box. Or maybe like a little pop-up thing. I don't know which side it comes up. But yeah. Um, so you guys can watch that if you haven't seen it yet. Then I'm going in with the LA Girl Pro Conceal Concealer. Um, I'm in the shade Creamy Beige and I'm just going to be sort of highlighting the areas that I want but also concealing at the same time. Going in with the Catrice Prime and Fine Mattifying Powder, and I'm just gonna sort of set those areas. Then I'm going in with the Catrice Sun Glow Bronzing Powder. I really enjoy using this product. It's probably time for me to try a different <laughs> bronzing powder, but anyway, whatever. blush I'm gonna be using the blush I don't know even how to say this word pro pro dish pro dog anyway it's a blush from Catrice and I mean the shade rosewood Alright, so I'm gonna be doing my brows now and I think I'm just gonna do that off camera because it takes the longest and um yeah i actually want to do a brow tutorial for you guys just not a tutorial but more just like how i do my brows um so yeah i'm gonna do that in a separate video so i'm gonna go in with my sealy in the light palette and i'm gonna use the shade bliss which is this it's almost like a dusty rose kind of a color what this is gonna do is it's gonna act as sort of like a setting setting powder for the concealer that we put on earlier on 
Then I'm going in with my Inglot Feed and System palette and I'm going to just be using the brown shade from this palette. It's the shade 299 from Inglot. Then I'm taking a clean fluffy brush and I'm just going to make sure that there are no harsh lines and everything is blended properly. Okay, so on to one of my favorite steps. This is the Clarence 3 Dot Liner in the color black. And I know it sounds a little bit intimidating. I'm going to be speaking about this in my next tutorial as well. And it might seem a little bit intimidating, but I promise you it's not. Um, I actually find this quite easy to use. So I'm just going to do a quick wing liner. So can you see like when you fill it in you can actually use it flat and then it fills in the space for you. It actually does all the work. That is our first wing done. It's actually quite a little bit of a, I wouldn't say a graphic liner, but it's a bit thicker than I usually do, but I quite like it. The mascara I'm using is the Extra Long Lash uh, Mascara. I really enjoy using this on both my top and bottom lashes. Um, it's got like a silicone uh, brush, which is really nice to get like deep into the root. And also it's not like thick, so it doesn't get clumpy on your bottom lashes. So the lashes that I'm using is from a brand called Misha. If you guys follow me on my blog for a while, you know that I collaborate with um, Infinity from YDE and Misha as well. So Misha has come out with a beauty product, which are these beautiful lashes. Um, so this is how they look. They are so stunning and it's like, honestly, like when you wear them, they look more like lash extensions than falsies. And we see this big difference. Um, and they look more like lash extensions. So when Misha was wearing them for the first time, I was like, do you have lash extensions? And she's like, no, they are falsies. So they are absolutely stunning. And when I wore them to the Luxottic event, like I got so many questions on them, like are those lash, lash extensions? Like where did you get your lashes done? And um, yeah, this is the secret ingredient. Um, these are in the, style i was almost gonna say shade these are in the style wow she has three different ones so there's a natural there's glam and then there's wow so i got the wow ones and they're amazing so while i'm waiting for the lashes to get a little bit tacky i'm gonna just complete the rest of my face with like highlight and my little dot so for highlights i'm gonna be using the gold meets pearl highlight nothing new nothing different the same because i'm obsessed and then to set that i'm going to be going in with the inglot uh, hd highlighter Okay, so time to apply these falsies. Sometimes I even 
On the day, I wore little black dots under my eyes and I created it with that three dot line as well. So I'm just gonna do that quickly, super easy, like it's literally just a dot. And then I'm just gonna apply the uh, extra long lash to my bottom lash lip, to my bottom lashes. While I'm waiting for my lashes to dry, I'm just going to finish off my lips and then the look will be complete. I'm going in with the NYX lip liner in... What shade is this? Natural. I'm going in with MAC Kind of Sexy. And then on top of that, I'm going in with Roma London 90s Baby. So to just make my skin look extra dewy and radiant, I'm going to go in with the Body Shop Energizing Face Mist. This stuff smells amazing and I use it all the time. And then what I like to do just before I finish off my look, I just want a tight line so that you can't really see that much of a difference between the falsies and my natural lashes. Oh, by the way, I'm using a MAC uh, eyeliner. I don't know what it's called. So there you have it, guys. This is a finished look. This is the exact look that I wore to the Luxottica event. Um, and then I posted it like on Insta story or something like that. I don't know. But yeah, I really hope that you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!